up welcome to today's video so today i'm going to be trying on my entire garage clothing collection i wear garage just about every day at least one item from garage i have uh sweaters crew necks flannels t-shirts tank top bodysuit pants jeans sweatpants hoodies jackets belts it's my favorite store to shop at okay let me just show you my bed. oh jeez um, I have it all sorted out into files. I'm just gonna go ahead and start today's video because it's gonna take me a little while. <laughs> just a quick disclaimer, I'm not, I don't wanna come off in any way as bragging. I know that most people won't think I am, but just in case, if you do. I do have quite a bit of clothes from here. Most of my clothes are from garage. So like at least 80 or 90% of my clothes are from here. I'm not trying to brag in any way because I'm very thankful for all the clothes that I have and I just want this to be for entertainment purposes. <laughs> all right, let's get on with it. First, I'm gonna be doing my tank tops and my bodysuits and I'm gonna be doing my t-shirts, all of my long sleeves, and then my pants and then my like accessories, so like my belts. And then I'm gonna be doing my jackets and hoodies. Very first shirt to start off the video. It's this white tank top with a little butterfly on it. Um, the butterfly is like orange, red, and yellow. This tank top is exactly the same as the one I just showed you. It's just a different color. It's light blue and it says angel on it. I have this yellow crop top. The straps are like super thin. I don't know, I really like the color of this one. I thought it was really cute. This one is very similar to the one I just showed you. It's literally just the same thing but in white. This one has a really cool backing to it. Once again, like the strap is like super thin. So this is the first bodysuit that I have. I've never really worn this one before because I don't know what to wear with it. It's a very like vibrant bright color. Looks like that in the back. It's a different material than the two tank tops that I just showed you, but it does have the same strap to it. The orange bodysuit, I'm pretty sure I've worn out like once or twice, but this one I haven't worn out at all because it's really big on me. Like these, the straps to it, are like really big on me. I'm gonna keep it until I grow into it because I really like it. It like cinches at the front right there. To start off the t-shirts, I have this red one with white stripes on it. This was probably one of the very first shirts I ever got from Garage, but it has like that cool material on the edges. It has a zipper down the front with this little like circle zipper. I, th I think it's really cute. This t-shirt is probably one of my favorites from Garage. Usually with these kinds of t-shirts, I layer long sleeves under it, but this shirt is like kind of long. Like it's <laughs> it's awkwardly long, I don't know. So I always just tuck it in when I wear it. This t-shirt, I've never really found the right pants to wear with it. It says New York City in the 1990X. It's a really short crop top and it's also see-through. I probably wear it with like something high-waisted to school. Okay, <laughs> this t-shirt I always feel like Kim Possible in. It's this super tight black t-shirt turtleneck. Usually I like to like bring the turtleneck down a little bit. This t-shirt has a really weird material to it. It's kind of like uncomfortable to wear, but I think it's really cute. It also has that like a uh, cool edging to it. I got this one really recent, like probably the last time I went shopping. I have very mixed feelings about this shirt. I like the back of it. I think it looks cool, but it's just like a button down shirt. I just, I've never really worn this one before. I haven't worn it a lot it's really tight and it has like, these stripes i really like the color of this one i don't own anything in this color this one has the cool edging to it to start off the long sleeves i have my favorite crew neck sometimes i wear it zipped up but like i feel like i look so like it's super fuzzy in the inside. This is probably my favorite long sleeve from Grads that I own. So I have this sweater. I never know how to wear it, like if I wear it like unbuttoned as like kind of like a cardigan. This shirt I got, uh, I think like last summer. It's this dark green and it's super, super tight. Obviously this one's a crop top. I have this sweater. This is probably the only zip up that I really wear. Um, usually I wear it unzipped anyways with like a white tank top under it. This sweater is cut off, it's like, half white half gray uh this one's just a super plain sweater i have this this light blue and white sweatshirt this crew neck is literally the exact same thing as my other one this one is literally just a solid white and the other one's an off-white as you can see like 
there's literally no difference between them. It's just the color. I don't, <laughs> I don't know why I got both. I just threw on this tank top under this one. I have this flannel. I'm pretty sure this I got as a hand-me-down from my sister. It's really soft and comfy. I'm standing on a chair, but it's really long. <laughs> um, I have another flannel that I also got as a hand-me-down. <laughs> Jeez. This one kind of reminds me of a jacket almost. I don't know, it has a hood in the back. This one is also super long, um, but as you can literally see, it's blue, not red. One of the main reasons why I originally got this shirt is because my mom really liked it. It's a gray turtleneck. It's like, it's so soft and it's literally, it feels just like a sweatshirt wearing it. This sweater I got, I'm pretty sure when I was in like either grade six or grade seven, I remember it being huge on me. Like this was way too big on me. It's an off white with like burnt orange red stripes on it. This one's really comfy, but it's really staticky. <sighs> this shirt I recall wearing once to school. I wore it with a jean jacket. I look like I have a floating head. It's really soft. I don't know why I don't wear it more often. It's literally so nice. I feel like back to school season, there was a lot of turtlenecks at the store. So I got them. I need to stop. <laughs> this sweater I used to literally wear all the time. I still really like it and I think it's cute. I think I just overwore it. I wore it all the time in grade seven. <sighs> I also kind of feel like where's Waldo. <laughs> Um, I have these gray high-waisted sweatpants from there. I feel like they've been washed like one too many times, so they're like not even fuzzy anymore. <laughs> they're like uncomfortable to wear. Sorry, I just put a flannel on because I feel like a lot of my stomach is showing. I don't know, I got these like two years ago, but they just started fitting me like uh maybe like six months ago. Next pair of jeans. They're black and high-waisted. They don't have any rips in them. They have these like weird bottoms. I don't know, they're kind of like distressed at the bottom. My first accessory is this chain belt. I actually really like this belt. I think it's so fun. I did not put this belt on like all the way because it literally takes forever. It's this black belt with a buckle on it. I also really like this one. I also forgot to mention that this green scrunchie is from Grudge 2. My camera battery is literally gonna die, but I have this black dress with this little cutout right here. This white fluffy jacket that's from Garage. I have this hoodie that is super, super soft and it was a hand-me-down. And then finally, I have this windbreaker that's white, black, and gray. And it used to be my sister's. Oh my God. Sorry the end of the video was like super rushed. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Thank you so much for watching. My camera battery is literally flashing. It's gonna die like any second. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up and um, comment down below. I don't know. <laughs>